Ellis Spear is a very interesting figure from the Civil War, alternately credited with being born in Warren. He is several years younger than Joshua Chamberlain and actually attends Bowdoin, and Chamberlain is one of his professors. He's six years younger than Chamberlain. Chamberlain enters into the 20th Maine in 1862, followed shortly thereafter by one Ellis Spear. Spear winds up being second in command of the 20th Maine. 1862, September, they go from Maine to the front. September, October, November, December, and then six months later, they're marching into Gettysburg. And Spear is second in command. Uh, he's rising in the ranks. Chamberlain has already risen in the ranks. He almost has brigade status at this point. But there's a closeness to the men. They are friends. They have respect for one another. When Chamberlain and the 20th Maine attain their glorious status with their stand at Little Round Top, one of the people who can attest to what happened and who provides his own account of what happened on Little Round Top is Ellis Spear. Afterwards, there were some people who were critics of Chamberlain, and this was years after, and they were wondering whether this guy who was a you know, professor of rhetoric at Bowdoin and uh, just, you know, too smart for his own good, he somehow glorified his own exploits and maybe didn't sell the rest of the regiment the way he should have. And Alice Spears said, you're wrong. He said, what Colonel Chamberlain said, what he wrote, is what happened. When we did the wheel right down the hill, this is what happened. Now, Chamberlain was not leading the charge. It was more likely that he was at the intersect point where the, the unit bent like a door. But the fact was they charged down the hill and he issued the order to fix bayonets when they were out of ammunition. Spear goes on, he continues as, as commander of the 20th Maine and throughout the rest of the war, Spear and the 20th Maine are essentially joined at the hip. There were battles where uh, the 20th Maine, right on through to Appomattox, Spear is right there with them every step of the way. Thanks for watching. And don't miss a single episode as we delve into the fascinating history of Maine's role in the Civil War. Please like and subscribe now.